and welcome back to Sevtech Space Crabs. Hello, Duck. Last time we managed to get ourselves 42 diamonds. I know, 42. that was a big achievement, actually. So we can make them into whatever we want. Shin's not with us today, he's streaming. He's setting up um, for the Jingle Jam yeah. streams. So yeah, if you guys have been watching that, I'm sure there's going to be some sips and Shin Minecraft, actually. That's what they're doing yeah. right now. Right now. Um, I am going to make these hard drives and start moving everything over. So it's kind of just an admin, okay, a job that's needed doing now, for a while. What's up? I, I, I guess I'm going to try and still charge my, my space suit. Uh, so I can get there. Where? How far away is it to to to, to build a decent charger? Well, I I kind of don't know why the other one doesn't work. Right. Because I'm a bit worried that making a tier three version of one that doesn't work might not be the best idea. Well, I've made ten one k storage drives. I can't okay, make wow. the four k ones, so that's, which is a big one. That's ten k then. Well, the thing is, that, yeah, these the, I've built another disk drive as well. I think I could throw these in here. So yeah, okay, so. This is the storage. Oh, huh. now I can put stuff in the computer. So I just read something oh. on the armor that I just obviously had never read before. Right. Can it only be charged with an energy storage module. Right. Oh, what if you put one in there? Yeah. <laughs> Hang on, I'm just typing in energy storage module. Oh, it's the Galactic Craft Core energy. Oh, right. That'd be easy. So it's three batteries and three six compressed steel. They just do compressed tin and compressed redstone. Tin and redstone. And coal. Okay. Coal. So here's the computer, Doug. Look. Hard drives. Oh, wow. So this is a refined storage disk drive. This one kind of looks like a face. So is you it, what I mean? And we can put things in it now. With eyes. It actually works. It actually works. Holy crap. I'm going to fill it with stuff. Well, this is what this is my favorite part of any Minecraft oh, mod pack. Diamonds going in. Filling up the, the, the Fluid computer. Fluid crystals going in. And just so seeing how much it can handle. Iron. So I think the big... Putting my space suit in. These small hard drives are great for storing lots and lots of very low stack things. Right? right. But as soon as you start getting like thousands of materials in there, you need bigger hard drives. Okay. But this is good for us because we've got a lot of random shit. Oh you know man, I mean? my bag is just already like just amazingly empty. I love it. And we can use this. But unfortunately... I don't. Oh, there's a way to search in it. Yeah, top. Okay, so it does work. You could search stuff. Yeah, look, boobs. No, no boobs in there. There's no boobs in there. <laughs> it's disappointing. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go and start taking all the stuff and yeah, filling little, it up. Let's have a little sleep first. Okay. So um, we. Uh, you just collapse on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just tired. I'm that tired. Oh yeah, I don't even need. You don't even oh, need. Of course, yeah, because Shin's not here. So we're um, gonna we're gonna get rid of this? every chest. Oh my god! I'm every single one. Every one. Every goddamn Every one. chest. I'm so excited. I'm just gonna. Oh yeah, I was gonna pipe it all, wasn't I, into the computer? I was gonna build a pipe so I didn't have to run it all by hand. Good idea. Because that seems like uh, what you can also do crazy. is if you shift right click on a chest, you can move it manually. Um, oh. I don't want to do that. And then just plot it down next to the computer, so you can just move move it to like a pipe, and then swatch them out. You know oh, I, mean? I see. If I have a pipe. Yeah. Okay. That way you don't have to make like hundred pipes. You just. Move a chest to the pipe next to the computer and it'll pipe it in. Well, I'm already, let's see, full of... I've already filled one hard drive. Okay. That's <laughs> which fine. Is, which is not great. That's fine. Uh, it's 21% full. Mm. Mm. Well, let's just Maybe we should leave out the things that aren't important at all. Keep it going. Oh, I could have a clear out. Yeah. So the classic way to do this, I've seen to recall before, is that you either have, like, big things, um, and you... Sorry to knock it down all of your lovely sign signage. Ah, um, you either have like it's new age. You either throw away a lot of the crap that you don't want into like yeah. a, a series of trash bins next door, or you have like the, the things that have like thousands and thousands. You have those in barrels, or right? Like separate chests, like a golden chest full of um, like over over the over extra storage for the millions of ores, or you know if you've got like a million cobblestone. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I'll look into it. I'm just gonna first of all, I'm just gonna empty these chests and see how much we can handle. Do we have any steel? Can we handle. Why, do, why not search the? Why not search the computer, Duncan? I know. Uh, what happened to our blast furnace? Did someone break it? Uh, no, it should be working. I just it possibly has either run out of coal. No, it's like it's not a blast furnace anymore. It's just a bunch mm. of bricks. Wow. How did it get broken? I'm guessing someone threw an angry pebble at it, it replaced it, but didn't actually make it into the, the block again, the hammer. Right. 
I don't know who could have done I that. I wonder who could have done that. There you go, I fixed it. I don't know anyone who might <laughs> do such things. <laughs> it's just, a, just an assumption. <laughs> I feel like anything that goes wrong is automatically blamed on Shin, where it, it could well be any of our fault. It could be, but it's unlikely. Because we would generally fix something if we broke it. Um, well, we've not got a great reputation for doing that, though, <laughs> to be fair. Oh, man, it's good to it's going to be good to have everything in one place because mm. there's random, like, obsidian and shit like this, you know, blocks of coal, random crap capacitors in, like, all over the place. Yeah, it'd be nice to actually have them all Having together. it all located in the same sort of place would be... I missed computers. Would be top. Ah, we have 12... We only have 12 steel ingots left. Ooh. I reckon it all got compressed, which might mean I don't need to compress this one. Yeah, if you don't yeah, have anything, there's just, loads of compressed steel just, here. Okay, we're good. We're just good. Let me know if you don't have anything. Just let me know, and I'll see what I can do. Because I'm, I'm going to be your backup. Today. Okay. Right. That's it. That's, that's the whole of this factory moved over. So that's positive. Hooray! But yeah, there's still a lot to do. Maybe what I want is a wireless computer terminal. Ooh. Yeah. Do you remember that thing? I do. And Wireless I love it. Grid, it's called. We have the infinite storage thing as well. Do I have one of those? I'm pretty sure I found one. It um, will need a thing called a wireless, like, can't. transmitter. Okay. Yeah. 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 Which I can make quite easily using an engineering processor. So it doesn't need the calculation processors. Okay. I do want to get a computer crafting bench. Because I think that will be really handy. You need that giant chamber thing, don't you? Yeah. That that is not easy to do. That's like late, late game, super late game. No, just like a crafting grid. Sorry, not the oh auto right, yes, thing, yes, yes, the yes, crafting yes, yes, grid on of course the grid. Yeah, that's definitely getting one of those. Um, don't even bother with a normal terminal. Is there well, a, is there um one for there one. um what's it called <laughs> the uh, no. Craft, well, the, is it called a crafting terminal? Oh, it? there is a crafting grid. Okay, it does yeah. require an advanced crafting table. Makes sense. Um, which I think we can make relatively easily. Advanced crafting tables. I think they're the ones that don't need manually, and they just they just need uh, gold and luminescence. Luminescent gold. Well, gold. I found another gold mine somewhere. I didn't pick it up though. Uh huh. So if we need more gold, I don't think we will though. I think we've got loads somewhere. Where the crap is all our coal? So most of the coal <laughs> will have been put through the blast furnace and turned into coal coke and turned into steel. Because I put any coal that I could find in the chest by the thingy. Um, so okay, all the coal, was, no coal. Was, was plugged into here. None at all. <laughs> and it's all gone through. Yeah. I've got, I've, got two, I've got a block which I can now turn into. Um, and we've got four stacks of cold coke here. Right. So what I'm actually doing with this cold coke now is I'm not using it in the blast furnace anymore. Mm -hmm. I'm grinding it up into um, in the crusher to make coke dust. And then that goes through and combines with iron in the arc furnace to make steel quickly, more quickly. Okay, that's good. So I'm actually not using the blast furnace to make steel anymore. Okay, we're going to need to find... That's probably why it was broken. A new coal mine. Because then. I didn't want it you to never, be used. never used it. There'll be a... There'll be a coal mine nearby. I can mine it out real fast as well, if you want. Where's our millstone? <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. What are you looking for now? I've just got a block of coal I want to turn into into actual. I just need. I need like three coal. That's uh, all I need. There's thirteen coal here. Ah, oh, where? And in just random chests. <laughs> have you checked the computer, by the way? As well? I did. Yeah, I only had blocks in it. Where are you? I'm in the room that you are. You were in. There we go. Uh, coal coke. I'm following you. Oh, here you go. Coal me up, Scotty. Thirteen coal. Oh, thank you. You giving me that back? That coal coke. Yeah, I thought you'd like that. Hmm. It was on the floor. I think having an Ender IO cable running length the breadth of the base actually is a legit strat. It will allow me to quickly move things into the computer and also um, be able to craft be able anywhere. to have stuff come out of the computer. Um, I mean, it's, it's Ender IO cables, Ender IO conduits. I love them to bits. They're fantastic. They're not even in this bloody mod pack. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. What well, have we got then? Hmm. What, what cables have we got? Well, I've been using these ones, these item extraction cables of cyclic, but they're a bit basic. Basic bit. 
Okay, I've got some batteries. Um, got some steel charging module, energy storage module. Okay, so we'll charge this old old thing. Get rid of this charger because that's useless. And we'll charge this one instead. Oh man, it's already taking shape. Look at this. I'm already getting like a whole load of things in the computer. Shulker shell, stuff that I didn't know where it was, slime balls, different types of slime balls, HV wire coils. Two there's two spacesuits in here. Did you put uh, yours in there? Yes, I put mine in there. Yeah. It's a good idea. Storage. Okay. Can I where is it? I'm gonna get my I'm gonna see if I can charge my spacesuit now. Alright. I'm gonna code a space again. So this is gonna be a wireless transmitter. I'm gonna put it on this cable here. Bam. Yeah, it's charging! It's charging, Lewis! My space suit! Holy shit, and I just put this fucking amazing looking wireless transmitter down. Mm. Which looks awesome, by the way. Oh yeah! Look at that thing! Um Boop. I do now need Boop. to make, however, Boop. another grid and a crafting Boop. grid. So okay, no. So I was thinking I can make a. Um, Do we wireless... need these death compasses in here from the between lands? <laughs> I could. I think I'll. I'll, I'll make it so death compasses get from the, put into the bin. This is the fourth of July. This death. The fourth of July. <laughs> yeah. Independence, Independence Day. Independence Day. Oh we died God. in the between lands. <laughs> I'm gonna find a lot more death compasses in the old base that I'm mm. gonna bring through. By the way, <laughs> just so you know. Oh God. But I think what I might do is make a wireless transmitter and run the cable over here instead, because cable is relatively cheap. Yeah. Computer cable. So you make another transmitter over there. What's the range on it? I don't know. That's what I'm gonna find mm. out. It, w I do need quite. I a few I think it's the range on the. Maybe it's the range on the. Because we need to have our own terminals, don't we? That we carry around. It's just lots of chests, quartz infused iron, and red so It's easy. The cable's very, very easy. Yeah, and I could, I could just make like a kind of attachment to the computer over on this side. Mm -hmm. Have like a few import exports. We would get rather than running. I'll just, I'll just run the computer to this side, and then the computer can be built into like the walls, and then it can take over. Hooray. Take over the base. Right, I've got my spacesuit charged, Lewis. I'm gonna, I might go to the moon again. See if I can find um, that moon rock. Right. Meteor meteoric iron. Do you think? Um, are you ch have you got a charged spacesuit? Yeah, fully charged. Okay. Fully hmm. charged. This is this is progress. Right. Well, shall I shall I go to the moon? Well, I mean, I, I'm not against the idea. I will right. say that. But uh, gee, full fuel. Right. Going. Okay. See you later. Okay. Have you got? A Got oxygen. Can you go got back? Can you come this back time? when it's like? I'm assuming there's enough fuel to get me back. Assuming, Duncan, make mm. some ass out of you. Well, all the Apollo missions had enough fuel to get them back. Right, I see. But oh, I can see you take it off. Goodbye. From up there. I'm waving some copper wire. At Farewell. You. Goodbye. Woo! Off to space I go. It's kind of ominous that my death. Compass mark. My death waypoint is like almost exactly. parallel to your <laughs> rocket. It's launch like I'm getting trajectory. beamed up. <laughs> yeah, it's quite weird. Woo! Goodbye, Earth. Bye, cruel Earth. Oh, base looks amazing from up here. You can yeah. see all the different ages. Bam! I'm going to switch today as well. Watch. <gasps> Boom. Didn't make any difference. Didn't I'm not. in space. Oh. Ain't no night in space. No night. <laughs> now let's see if this works this time. Because last time I saw a big colourful mess and then I crashed. I never had a chance to press space to slow down. Right. Well, that's oh, that's uh, not good if it's badly broken. <laughs> but it may be because I didn't have a spacesuit on or a parachute. Do you have ah, both of those? This time so. we have a lander and I can press space. Okay, it's working. I am now subject to 0% radiation. That's good. 0%. Yeah, that's, that's what I want, right? As opposed to like 25%. <laughs> well, I didn't even have that thing last time. I didn't even say anything. I just had a mess of color. Uh, so I'm landing, Lewis. I'm landing on the moon. Here is the moon. Landing in the crater of my last uh, disastrous attempt. Ah, now, hmm. Go on. I, did, I, do, I do remember now that this mod gives you a lander and the rocket is like in the infantry of the lander and then you have to put the, la the rocket down and... Uh, put the fuel in the rocket. Mm -hmm. Now, I haven't bought a fuel loader with me. Well, that's your bad, I suppose. Yeah, I was thinking of advanced rocketry, where you'd had enough fuel to get back. <laughs> mm. Well, 
Uh, there is fuel. Oh, well. But I can't get it from the lander into the rocket. Right, I'm going to take this advanced <laughs> crafting table. I am, I'm going to have to abandon this rocket. This, no, I can... Actually, no, because I've got... I can just abandon the mission. Because there's, there's a new abandoned mission system. So we're okay. I'm going to take this cra advanced crafting table token. Okay. And I'm going to make it into... a make it grid into a crafting grid if that's okay all right and that I'm way a, we'll have a crafting on the, grid on our computer i'm on the moon lewis and it will be way easier i'm on a goddamn moon i'm excited for you lewis i'm on the moon well done duncan look at me look at me mom i'm on the moon mom get the camera so do you want moon dirt turf or dirt i or want rock? moon dungeon block moon dungeon block oh, because God. that we need that to make the calculation press well i just came here to make a paper clip um Okay. Well, no, you can do that. Um, <laughs> we also need you. You need. Did you make that wizard that dungeon spawner? No. What do you need for that? Um, it's called dungeon spawner detector. Harry, the dungeon spawner. <laughs> the wizard. What do I need for it? A, a ender pearl and some moss stone. I didn't make that. I, I'll, I'll do it another time. I can always come back here. I got my rocket. That's all right. I can get Nas to come pick me up. Okay, I'm going to look for some meteors, Lewis, from Meteoric Iron. I need more silicon, because uh, each of these things requires four silicon. Silly, silly, really. What is silicon, what's it all called on the, the landscape? What's it like, what's its sample called? It's called silicon. Right. Yeah. Uh, hello, alien villagers. They're like shrink-wrapped now. In bubble, in um, bubble, in a spacesuit. I need a frequency module to communicate. They're bubble oh. wrapped. I didn't bring a frequency module. Oh, is that to trade with them? Yeah. Is that the thing that you attach to your yeah um, helmet? It is. Um, I'm talking oh, well. about your space helmet, not your. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Because only James T. Kirk does the other kind of um, communication diplomacy. <laughs> of aliens. Yeah. Yeah. Right, let's dump all of these other things in here. Oh, oh, God, well, I've got well, so, well. so many mats Although to bring Tony back. Stark did sleep with Gamora. Do you know that? In the comics. In the comics? Yeah. Oh, really? Well, Tony Stark's a pretty dream, dreamy guy. How long ago <laughs> was that as well, though? Quite recently. It was in Guardians of the Galaxy, which is fairly recent. Whoa. Yeah. How, does, how did Star-Lord feel about that? I'm not sure if you knew. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It feels, feels, feels bad, man. I just remember the after-sex after scene... After scene was Tony Stark lying in bed just says ow <laughs> <laughs> ow yeah wow because she's a she's a beast oof oof <laughs> <laughs> oh holy shit okay I've nearly used up one oxygen tank and haven't found any moon rocks yet I'm filling up the computer with metal okay now I've got 1.2k aluminium for example can you put liquid metals in the computer um, yeah, yeah, you can have liquid storage, you can, can't you? Can you? Liquid storage. It's quite an interesting way to you can like pour them out stuff. as ingots. Pour one out for the lads. Like, can you pour directly out of the PC into a casting basin, for example? Because that would be awesome. I don't um, know, but I think probably. Wouldn't that be cool? Like, you need like a, a sword head, so you just pick a, a liquid from the PC, cast it out. Bam! No smelting, no nothing. Sounds amazing. I know, right? I don't know if that's possible. I've never done that oh, before. Oh, the graphite electrodes are knackered. Oh, really? Yeah. About time. They lasted like ages. No, I replaced them, didn't I? Uh, or at I least I got new ones. I remember. Okay, tank one is down. Repeat, tank one is down. I'm on my backup tank. No meteors yet. Anyway, I've just built 12 cables. I think I can build more. Yeah, okay, I'll get like... A stack and a half, and I'll see if I can run this towards the old base. Okay. Um, that way the computer will be linked into the old base, which I think would be pretty DM, DM cool. Well, I am running low on oxygen, so I'm going to have to abandon this mission. All right. But I think I'll come back with the, the scanner to find the um, the dungeons, dungeons. And then you can get the meteors at the same then time. While, while that's going on, hopefully some meteors will fall around me yeah uh, but i'm gonna have to abandon this mission because there's no way that i can get this rocket back home um no 
and unless it's got fuel in it, which I don't think it has because I think the land has got it all. So yeah, next time I'll bring a uh, fuel loader and some kind of power system. It's nice that you it. can just abandon missions now. It's like, well, yeah, do you know what? You know what? I forgot the can't, fuel loader. NASA, come and get me. I, I need help. It's like yeah. the Martian. It's like, but you oh. just do you, do, you, do you lose your rocket? <laughs> no, well, I don't... It doesn't appear to be the case. You got it back before, mm. right? Yeah, no, well, I've, I've got I've got it on me, and I've got key imagery on it. Oh, I see. Um, That's handy, then. I don't remember what the command is, though, Lewis. To abandon mission. Well, we can abandon this episode. Anyway. <laughs> Thanks, everyone, for watching. See you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.